the delay in returning your call. Now, our second court all morning. Now, about the December issue. I'm going to have to call you back. Yes, it's just one distraction after another these days. What are you doing? Uh, well, I know that uh, Kate Howard only eats fat-free chicken with salad. But, you know, Connie fucking Ari used to love pizza from the old neighborhood with some beer on ice. You know, it's real cold. I've just, I've come here to uh, thank my old friend Connie for coming through for me today. It's the closest thing we have to Tony's Pizza from the old neighborhood. As you can see, um, thin crust, spicy sauce. We got the beer that was on ice. It was real cold. So when you, you know, open it. What are you doing? I am thanking you because of what you did understand. You're making Rick look like a fool. And I am making you an offer that you cannot refuse. I can under no circumstances eat pizza. We're just going to keep this like our little secret. You know, like everything else about it. It's just pizza. Why is it so hard for you to accept anything from me? Oh, Sonny. Not everything is about you. Well. Look, I have a museum party in... Ah. Uh, the next month, and I'm wearing a Neil Laurent original, and it's not going to drape right if I'm packed in it like a sausage. Speaking of sausage... <laughs> this used to be your favorite. Come on. You know that you like that. Take it. Take no, it. it was your favorite. Mine was pepperoni and extra cheese. And hot dogs at Coney Island, fire hydrants uh, to cool off, fully dressed. Now you won't even risk getting wet in the shower. I am someone who lives a very different life. Don't look at me like that. What, you still boost cars? Whatever. There was a time when I couldn't say that here. Well, I wish I had known then, so I'd have tried, mm. you know, for that extra. Yeah, well, it's your loss. Because now I'm a woman who can say no to anything. Mm -hmm. It's all about self-control. It's crucial, and I won't let go of it. Well, you won't let go of anything. That's the problem. Like, you know, unless we're talking about those pills you accidentally took from your boss. Yeah. You know, those enhancing See, drugs. Gentlemen wouldn't feel the need to remind me of Well, I'm not trying to be disrespectful, Connie. I'm just saying, you, it, it just seems like you can't have fun anymore. Ah, uh, you mean, <laughs> excuse me, your what? idea of fun. See, what you don't get, this works for me. I'm comfortable with who I am, and I'm not going to change it for anyone. It's my idea of fun, and I'm sorry if it doesn't meet your standards. Everything else aside, it was nice of you to bring this to me. Yeah. Well, it was great the way you handled Rick's questions. And I was kind of surprised since you accused me of using you as an alibi. Oh, I'm just being honest. I found the DA's whole line of questioning absurd. So what, you get one phone call in front of me and supposedly leads to order this Alcazar person's murder? Mm-hmm. It's melodramatic and silly. I mean, business people get lots of phone calls, at least 50 a day. It was a setup. Rick got you on the stand to establish that I uh, made that call. That way you can get Elizabeth on the stand to testify. She saw Jason get the call. Then he can harass Elizabeth, make Jason blow up, and prove Jason is dangerous. Well, if I was still Connor Falconary from Bensonhurst, I'd tell you brother Rick to get a life. Miss Howard, uh, can we get our ball out of the pond? Koi, lily, or meditation? Okay, hold on one second here. First of all, love you guys. What are you doing here, and where is your mother? Did your mom mention where she was going when she dropped you off without letting me know? She said that she could help Jason. That's it. <sighs> can you... For a couple of minutes, just watch them while I think it's up. Yeah, of course. How hard can it be? Very. So, can we please get our ball from the pond? Michael, honestly, what do you have against my koi? Not the fish. The one with the big flowers floating in it. My water lily pond? You, the one I had designed to look like a Monet painting? 
I guess. No, honey, no. No. I can't have you flailing about my pink carpensies. They're too delicate. Morgan, I'll, I'll buy you another ball. I like that ball. It's the last thing that Jax gave him before we left. Okay, well, you know what? We're just going to wait for your father to get back and he'll figure it out. In the meantime, there's pizza. Morgan, no, Morgan! <gasps> All right, make one right here. Look, see that one you just made? Look at that. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful water lily. Monet has nothing on you. Although, there's a water lily on you. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, you're fine. Ah!